Alright guys, my name is Bonnie Kimi and welcome back to another Fortnite video. Now you can probably guess from the title that I have something I want to share with you guys about what could possibly be in the Season 9 Battle Pass. And I think we're going to see it before then. Now over previous seasons, Epic Games have added things to the Battle Pass, cosmetic things that have changed up how we present ourselves in the game and things that we can customise our characters with. They added in back blings, they added in pets, then they added in cosmetic wraps for our guns. I'm pretty certain that the next thing that we're going to be able to change up with our characters is going to be hats. Now I'm going to tell you in a moment just why I think this, but before I do I just want to say that if you're enjoying this video at any point, a big massive thumbs up would be hugely appreciated, a comment below would be awesome, I love hearing from you guys, and if you're brand new here, please do consider subscribing and hitting that little bell to turn on notifications as well. Now why am I pretty certain that hats are going to be the next big cosmetic thing that we have available in Fortnite? And why do I think it's going to be in the Season 9 Battle Pass? Well I've already explained why I think it's going to be in the Battle Pass, because every season there seems to be a new cosmetic thing that's added in there that we can play around with. There wasn't one which was added into season 8 which is surprising and I think it was supposed to be hats but it's just not quite ready yet and that's why I think it's going to be a huge feature in the season 9 battle pass there's going to be some unlockable hats along the way but I think it's going to make an appearance before that in the item shop. I think we're going to have hats available to purchase in the item shop and the reason that I was, I was holding off on saying this until they released pets into the item shop because if you can buy pets which were, were previously battle pass only cosmetic uh, accessories then you're definitely going to add hats in as well and I think them releasing pets into the item shop now is uh, them preparing for bringing hats and things like wraps and all that just I think there's going to be one section of the item shop that is literally just cosmetic accessories and other section will be skins but yeah the evidence is there if you look at what Fortnite have been doing recently what Epic Games have been doing with Fortnite recently they've been giving us additional styles to existing characters and I think that is their way of kind of implementing this in step by step. If you look at the additional styles they've added, all of them remove, or almost all of them, sorry, remove the hat from the existing character. They did it with the fish sticks character. Added, added well, they actually didn't remove it, but they gave him a hat in that style variant. So now he has a hat on, hat off. They did it recently with the elite agent, where she had her hat, her headgear on, and now she has it off. Renegade Raider as well. And I think they're gradually just introducing these styles as a hat on, hat off style variant, so that they can actually, as soon as it's enabled, people have some skins to actually work with to see how this tests and plays out because it does need some testing if you think about it this this feature is already in the game and save the world version of fortnite you can uh, there's already characters there you can choose to have the hat on or hat off for some existing characters so the code's there the functionality is there but of course when it comes across the battle royale there's other things that need to be considered uh, when implementing this into a player versus player competitive environment you can't just implement it right away because it will affect things like hit boxes uh, and stuff like that so if you put the hat on does it affect your hit box like, I mean, obviously there's characters that have, hit bo that have hats on already so it shouldn't but I still feel like they need some testing and I, I think it does be some problems with it and that's why they've had to push it back I, I strongly believe it was supposed to be a feature of the season 8 battle pass and now they're pushing it back to season 9 and it's going to be a major feature in the season 9 battle pass and it's not just the previous skins that they've been adding style variants to if you look at some of the recent skins that have been added into the game they have clearly distinguishable hats look at the one that was added into the item shop a few days ago, the kind of banana safari ranger guy, clear distinguishable hat, they're in the battle pass as well, their hats are there, they seem to be, the hats, they're not just little head accessories, they're like big statements, you know, and I think that's them, they want these hats to be to be big things that you can put on or put off to really make a big difference to the character. So what do you guys think? Do you think this is a good idea? Do you think I'm correct? Do you agree? Do you disagree? Let me know in the comments below, I'd love to hear your thoughts on it. And that's all I really have to say on it, I'm pretty sure hats are coming to the season 9 battle pass, I'm pretty sure we're getting hats in the item shop before that. Um, now that pets have been released in there but I really want to know what you guys think about it let me know in the comments below thank you so much for watching leave a big massive thumbs up and of course subscribe if you're new here turn on notifications and I'll see you in the next one bye bye